Hello, everyone. Welcome back to. Today, we have an incredibly intriguing topic to explore, why is Gasara important? Gasara, which stands for the Global Economic Security and Reformation Act, has been a subject of much discussion and speculation. In this video, we'll dive into the key aspects of Gasara and unravel why it is considered significant by many. But before we begin, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss out on our thought-provoking content. Now, let's get started. To understand why Gasara is important, let's start with a brief overview. Gasara is a set of proposed economic reforms that some believe will reshape the global financial landscape. It is said to bring about positive changes, both economically and socially, on a global scale. One of the primary reasons why Gasara is considered important is its promise of global economic stability. Advocates argue that the implementation of Gasara would lead to fairer wealth distribution and reduce economic inequality. The act aims to eliminate corruption and manipulation within the financial systems of countries, fostering a more stable and transparent global economy. Gasara is designed to create a level playing field in the economic arena. By addressing issues like fraudulent banking practices and market manipulations, it seeks to restore trust in financial institutions and promote sustainable economic growth. Another significant aspect of Gasara is its proposal for debt forgiveness. Proponents argue that forgiving national debts would free countries from the shackles of excessive financial burdens, allowing them to allocate resources towards essential services such as healthcare, education, and infrastructure. Imagine a world where nations can focus on the well-being of their citizens without the constant pressure of looming debts. Gasara aims to create a more compassionate and socially responsible global community. Now, here's a fascinating element. Gasara includes provisions for funding humanitarian projects worldwide. These projects range from poverty alleviation and healthcare initiatives to environmental conservation efforts. By redirecting funds towards these causes, Gasara envisions a world where every individual has access to basic necessities and a chance at a better life. The humanitarian aspect of Gasara is crucial. It's not just about economic reforms, it's about using the resources of the world for the betterment of humanity. The act encourages a shift in priorities, emphasizing the well-being of people and the planet. Gasara proposes a transition from the current fiat currency system to one backed by tangible assets, such as gold. Advocates believe that this shift would provide a more stable foundation for global currencies, reducing the risk of economic crises and hyperinflation. While this transition might sound ambitious, proponents argue that it is a necessary step towards creating a resilient and sustainable global financial system. Gasara is not just about economics it also carries geopolitical implications. Advocates argue that by fostering economic cooperation and transparency, the act could contribute to global peace and stability. The interconnectedness of economies in today's world means that economic instability in one region can have ripple effects worldwide. Gasara aims to create a more harmonious global economic environment, reducing the likelihood of conflicts arising from economic disparities. Of course, it's important to note that Gasara has its fair share of skeptics and critics. Some argue that the proposed reforms are too idealistic and may face challenges in implementation. Others question the legitimacy of the information surrounding Gasara. It's essential to critically evaluate any proposed changes and consider the potential challenges and drawbacks. While the vision of Gasara is inspiring, its actualization requires careful planning and international cooperation. In conclusion, the question of why Gasara is important is a multifaceted one. It promises economic stability, debt forgiveness, support for humanitarian projects, a transition to a new financial system, and geopolitical harmony. However, it's crucial to approach the topic with a discerning eye, considering both the potential benefits and challenges associated with such a comprehensive global reform. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of Gasara. What are your thoughts on this proposed global economic reform? Share your opinions in the comments below, and don't forget to like and share this video. Until next time, stay informed, stay curious, and stay tuned too.